morning, we have new information on a wild chase that ended with shots fired right on 285. GBI has released details on how the chase started, and we've learned an innocent bystander was hurt in it all. Fox 5's Alexa Liaco has those details for us. Oh, he just read. Oh. Witnesses captured the final moments of a dangerous police pursuit down I-285 southbound on Friday. Oh, man. Oh, they finna be his... The GBI says this all started when officers in an unmarked car saw a stolen black Nissan and followed it to this public's parking lot. When additional officers tried to approach the car, the GBI says the driver of the stolen Nissan, now identified as Devin Nolly, threw the car in reverse. The male subject drove his vehicle into one of the police cars. At that point, officers did fire shots at the subject. Nolly then took off towards I-285, leading officers on a chase. He taking them on the run. South Fulton police eventually joined the pursuit that ended in gunfire on the side of I-285. I noticed that the guy jumped out, and when he jumped out, I, I heard a gunshot. So when I heard a gunshot, that's when I heard multiple gunshots, and I noticed that the police was chasing him as they were shooting. He jumped over the, the guardrail and ran down into the ravine. After that, I didn't see him no more. Police shot Nolly multiple times. He's at Grady recovering. For Good Day Atlanta, I'm Alexa Liaco.